Kev, as we heard, you like basketball. Tell us a little bit about your, your passion for the game of basketball. Yeah, I like to watch it. I watch it a lot. Not, not live, obviously, because <laughs> it's always during the night, but like when we go to the hotel and there's been a, a good game, I will, I will watch it again. I have, I have the, the league pass, so I can watch NBA TV, uh, the games, and I always follow uh, first take on ESPN. Okay. What is the mental approach that you think it's the same between NBA players and top soccer player? I think is uh, the will to win. I think everybody's there to, to get a, a championship. For them it's a ring, for us it's, it's a cup, a title. So in the end you work really hard, you play for us every three, day, uh, three days of a football game. For them it's like eight months on the road to, to play games and yeah, in the end you want to you wanna be there to celebrate. If for one week you could be an NBA player, who would you be? Yeah, if I would say, if I wanted to be, it would be LeBron James. Okay. Just the way that he, he is, he, he's been the best since he, he came in the league. Yeah, you, you can see uh, what he does. Uh, it's not only the points, it's the way he leads the team, he leads everything in the team, defensive, offensive, the way he needs to conduct himself to, to the media, to the outside world, what he does for the people around. Mm -hmm. So I think in one way or another, the, his mindset on, on the basketball field is maybe a little bit the way I think. Mm -hmm. Like I, I know I need, need my people around me to, to win. I, I cannot do it by myself, maybe like, like he can do in the NBA because he's a physical wonder. I'm not really a physical wonder, <laughs> but no, I think, yeah, that's it. His mindset is the way, it's maybe what, what who, who I am uh, on a pitch. Forget about the job, forget about the stuff. How do you always wake up in the morning and be like, okay, today I gotta do it again? Sometimes very difficult for us to come back after a season when you just had two, three weeks off because I think more mentally than physically you, you need it, but I think in, in the end when you're playing on the field you're not thinking about anything. You're, you're working hard, but you're not thinking about how much you earn or how much supporters are thinking about you or, or, or something else. It's just you, your teammates, the ball and just play and that this is what I know what, what to do, For sure. so it, this is my job. Obviously everybody has a day like, it's tough today, but yeah, I don't have the feeling that I want to stop now, so okay. I, I can keep on going for the moment. Maybe I just... No way! No fucking way! <laughs> it's always better, you know, when you just do it. You just bounce it. No thinking, just do it. On sait qu'il y a énormément de joueurs belges talentueux euh, évoluant euh, dans les championnats étrangers. Mais bon, seulement un seul vainqueur. Le gagnant est Kevin De Bruyne. Kev, it seems like the majority of folks, they don't realize how hard you work. I don't really care because I think that that is everywhere. People don't know the, the work that we put into. Obviously, if you are at home resting, you're resting because you need to play on Saturday. Yeah. It's just part of the job. You need to go have the treatments, do the massages, training, go in the pool. So I think our job is 24-7, but obviously <laughs> it's, it, 
I love, I love my life, but we are busy. And in the end of the day, I don't care what people say. I can read comments. They just said it to me before. You read comments of people, what they write on the internet, because it makes me laugh. It doesn't affect me personally. It just, you know, it's, it's for me, it's banter yeah. in one way or another. And yeah, I, I like to read these things. I think uh, what, what I like the most is when people know that I'm a good guy, you know, that I'm, I'm respectful for everybody. It doesn't matter who you are, you can be the biggest star or they call the little guy. I have the same attitude towards him than, than the biggest star, I don't think. Everybody is, has his own job in society and obviously it's not because you have a lot of money or attention that you're bigger than, than other people. So I, I like it when people in the end say, oh, he's been a great player, but in the end he's been, been a great person. And I think people appreciate it more when, when you are like a great person than, than a great player even more. What makes Kevin De Bruyne so I mean, it's so tough, man. I, the thing is, I always take my decision almost by myself. When I was 14, I wanted to go away, uh, leave home to think it's the best option. And until now, every option I took has been the right option for me. Even with the time that I didn't play in Chelsea, it was the good time to go there to learn new things and then good time to, to go away. I don't mind um, having like these difficult times yeah. because in the end I, I had the feeling like no matter what I do, if I, if I follow what is in my head, what I'm feeling, in the end it's going to be alright and, and now I'm here, I feel happy and now I can look back at, at these things and know that I just have to do the same in, in the future, just follow mindset that I have and yeah, I think that's it and in the end uh, nothing is nothing is given to me it's always been against the odds it's always like a lot of people were against me in the beginning when I went to Genk they, they think you get special treatment and all these things and uh, it's been the same in the clubs that, that I've been before I always had the feeling that I had to show a little bit more and then yeah, now it's it's almost the opposite to be fair. How does it feel to know that your work, your drive, your passion echo to even your equal in other sports? Oh, that, that is a great uh, accomplishment for me because I, I, they know what a professional athlete has to do and obviously when fans are behind you it's a great feeling but obviously when when yeah like when big stars or, or uh, people from other stars uh, know your name and uh, know who you are that, that means like you really in, in, the, in the big leagues too, to be fair because there are so many good players it's the same yeah. you have so many good football players and you know, uh, it's not like I, I, I want to shine like it has to be me, but in one way it, it's just going good and it's nice when people know that. Uh-oh! Holy shit! Holy shit! Oh!